Good evening, my dear people of Talafofu. I'm the mayor of Talafofu, Mayor of Vicente Estaitui. My wife is Juanita San Nicolas Taitui. I've got one son, I've got five grandkids. So we're looking forward to more grandkids. I believe in big family. So I want to, you know, extend a heartfelt thanks to the people of Talafofu for the support they have given me for the last eight years. Half a day, family, friends, neighbors of uh, Talafofu and Ipan. I'm Wayne Ujoa, 2016 candidate for Talafofu mayor. Uh, my father is Ben Ujoa, retired police officer. Uh, my mother is Guadalupe Ujoa, and uh, I'm a longtime resident of Talafofu way back since my elementary years. Um, moved off island for a while and came back in two 2007. We were able to uh, upgrade our baseball field at a cost of about $800,000. Now the field is being used by everybody. Football, football fans, soccer, baseball. So it's a good thing. Everybody comes to have to use it. It's the only field available in southern part of Guam for our kids. The Jeremy Nubi Center you know, was uh, opened up and dedicated to a young man who uh, spent most of his uh, life here uh, out of school um, doing the activities that were at one time active in the community. Uh, currently now, year after year, it seems to be uh, dying out and it's run, the place is getting run down. And, you know, uh, they're making some minor improvements to the structure, but I'd like to see uh, inter, uh, an effective and interactive uh, programs. What's down the line for the Hotel Fofo? Yes, we're looking forward to uh, constructing a soccer stadium in Hotel Fofo for the soccer sleep in here in California. And, uh, we have all the land, we have the funding, all the organizations works in process. And, uh, another thing we're looking forward is to build a football field for our football players. There's no field down here. So we have to build one for our Southern Cowboys and maybe more you know, the islands. And also we're looking forward to uh, Bill, the Southeast Precinct here in Talafofu. We have the land, we have the funding from, the, from Gura, so we need to work on those things and get it going. Within the community center, those are vital to uh, community unity, um, with the youth uh, having positive programs that interact with the senior citizens. Um, one of the things we could do is a summer program where senior citizens can help teach the youth how to do regular household chores, things that we take for granted, you know, how to wash clothes, how to cook rice. Um, the senior citizens in turn can learn from the youth how to uh, get on the internet, you know, how to play a game, how to create an email or even Facebook, you know, bring them up to speed with technology. And I think that's where I'm coming from. My view would be more on innovation and trying to resolve the issues in Talapofu or take on the regular and everyday tasks that we do. I decided to run again because, you know, it was you know, it's, it's in my heart see, to serve people. I love to serve people, see, you know, even though people criticize, people talk, you know, it costs a lot of money to do these things. You know, I'm willing to help. You know, a lot of people here that need help, especially the low-income people, people that, you know, in the welfare. But uh, I'll take the risk and, uh, you know, I, I love it and I love the people and I love, I love to help them, even though it costs me some money on the side. But that's the way it is and it's the love in the heart that, you know, I think they want to show. Pretty much uh, with the skill set that I, I'm going to say I got from the, the, the mainland itself, as well as uh, the mayor, the current mayor, Mayor Tidegui, my experience in working his, his office is uh, the rapport you develop with the community, the trust that they have to come to you for, to resolve issues, although you know, you're, you're only uh, uh, an employee of the mayor's office. But it, it, I learned a lot watching how he worked with them, and be able to resolve solutions and it brought to mind how I would probably do it uh, you know and I guess I would just again use innovation today's technology uh, by maintaining uh, traditional practices that they do in the community. Again I come before you my dear people of Talfofo to humbly ask for your support come August 27. If we, if we need to move forward and I, th I believe we're in the right direction and moving forward despite our you know, limited resources, we're able to move things forward. So please, again, have faith in me. 
I'm fair for you guys. So again, please support me on this upcoming election. It's only, I have, there's no opponent on the other side. So I encourage all my Republican friends to come over and support, vote Democrat and vote that way, the real mayor. Half a day, friends and families in, of Talapopo and Ipan. My name is Wayne Ujoa. I sincerely would like to be your next mayor in 2017. Come uh, August 27th, um, I ask that you vote in favor of Wayne Ujoa, Democrat number two on the ballot in the mayoral race. A vote for Wayne is a vote for innovative solutions as well as responsible and accountable practices. Thank you and God bless you.